Welcome back. In this tutorial, we'll learn more about bump maps. A bump map is when you apply an image to a surface to create some 3D detail. Here I've got two logo images on my screen. Both are 300 dpi, as you see here. Now let's go back to Inventor. Open the Appearance Browser. I'll create a new generic appearance. And I'll call it Bump Map. Under the Generic section, click the Image field. Let's select the first logo, A.png, and click Open. Now double-click on the image to open the Texture Editor. Let's make the scale 1 inch by 1 inch, and close the Texture Editor. Close the Appearance Editor. Save our edits. Let's select these three faces. Now right-click on My New Appearance, and select Assign to Selection. Okay, let's zoom in a bit to take a better look. Now let's try applying a bump map to see how it changes. Let's check the bump box down below. We're prompted to browse for an image, A. Click open. Double click the image field. Here's the texture editor. Let's change the scale to 1 by 1 inch. Close the texture editor. Let's drag the bump amount up. This gives us a more defined texture. We get a decent preview in the graphic area, but let's go to the Environments tab and open up Inventor Studio so we can render the image. With default parameters, let's just click Render. And here's our image. Let's close it, finish Inventor Studio, back to the Appearance Browser, double-click on Bump Map to make some changes. Let's change the image we use for the bump map. This time I'll use the grayscale image, Logo B. Select it and click Open. Close the texture editor, and the preview in our graphic area updates accordingly. We have a different effect with this image as our bump map. Let's go to Inventor Studio and render it with default settings. Click Render, and here's our image. Let's close. Close the Render dialog window. And this concludes our tutorial about using a bump map.